Hello, uh, Doug from PV European Service. Uh, on your Volkswagen and Audi, it should have usually a pink antifreeze or a purple antifreeze, either a, it's a G12 or a G13 designation or even a G12 plus, something like that. And it's very important to only put pink coolant or purple coolant back into it, like all the colors should match. What you do not want to do is put green coolant in when there's already pink there. And a lot of people think like, oh, okay, it's just a little bit, there's really no harm. But there actually is. What happens is the green coolant and the pink or the purple coolant will react together and form a jelly. And this is what that jelly looks like when you drain it out. It's like that. So what happens is, is you have all these little bits of jelly, or like a gelatinous blobish stuff that just basically, you know, they can clog the heater core, causing, a, you know, no heat or low heat. They can clog different other small vent lines. So it's actually, you only want to put pink coolant in, or if you need to top it up, you can put a little bit of water in it, especially in the summer months, and then have the leak fixed, which usually involves draining the cooling system anyway, or to a certain degree, and then we'll measure how much pink antifreeze and how much water is in there, and then we can adjust the ratio accordingly so it is back to its proper level of about 50-50 mix. You want 50% coolant and about 50% distilled water. And that's it, but this is actually a really good example of like the jelly that it actually will turn. So that is it, have a good day.